Hi, Steven. Few questions about the quarter. I brought a new friend. Two minutes, more or less. Should be enough. Okay, it's watching you. What kind of a quarter was it for the bank? Yeah, the numbers look good. Interest income in both retail and wholesale banking was strong. Fee income went up, largely because of retail banking and wholesale banking. We had good trading results and with our focus on capital optimization, also good returns. And an increase of our primary customer base with 181,000 customers, largely across all retail markets. So not bad, I would say. So good numbers, but economies are slowing down. What do we feel? Hey, look, there are a lot of uncertainties and for sure the conflict in the Middle East doesn't help with that. Inflation is expected to come down in the next couple of months. But if oil prices surge, that could also have an impact on inflation. Economies in general are uncertain. But in that context, we're doing very well. Good results, low risk cost, strong capital. So I'm confident that we can withstand any shock and we can also keep our promise to our customers, serve them well. Some people say we're making too much profit right now. What do you say? I say that the numbers are big, but we're also a big company. Mm. Also, we do not steer and manage our bank on a quarter by quarter basis. We have to look at the long term. I look, for example, a year ago, then interest rates were negative. And last but not least, a strong and a healthy and also profitable bank is also good for all of our stakeholders, including our 38 million customers. And we have a new climate report. What jumps out for you? Yeah, what really jumps out is that we work with sectors, with steel, with automotive, with shipping, and we also measure progress. Now, to give you a number, in seven of the 10 sectors that we put in that report, we are on track for our 2030 targets and therefore on our way to net zero by 2050. We're doing a lot, but not yet enough to keep the planet healthy. And you also want to work with governments and regulators. What's your message to them? As a society, we want to become more sustainable. We want to get to net zero. In the end, it also means that governments need to give clear direction and clear policies per sector. We cannot do it alone if we want to speed up. That's all we have time for right now. The penguin has lost its patience. Thank you very much, Penguin. Well, thank you very much <laughs> for your answers and uh, good luck. Good.